church, but from this brotherhood, your first time here among this group of people. I'd like for you to stand at this time. Let's give them a round of applause. Acknowledgement, amen. Now, I know this is off the, the agenda, but this is how I'm. There's a young lady that I met. Can I start off with an example? There's a young lady that I met, and I'm telling you, I was so excited that I'm telling you, I, I could have went ran and had the church by myself. But I, you know, but I would like for Jessica Johnson. Amen. Jessica Johnson, y'all, come on. Jessica Johnson, come on now. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. came in, that was yesterday, I was like, I gotta meet her from yesterday. So today when they opened up, I was like, where is she? And I was like, going, that's how I was running on that child, like I want her first. But Jessica shared something with me. Jessica got ready to come here an hour before Belle Jr. and them got ready to come from Canada, Missouri. Now come on, somebody got to wrap up in the air. There. So I learned a little something about Jessica. Jessica, you know, as she started talking, she was interviewing me, but she had the knowledge. But what stuck with me, that Jessica decided to come an hour before. Yeah. Boy, that said a whole lot. Yeah. When you've been asking people to come over months and months ago, they still ain't make, they gonna make the next one. But an hour before, and I just wanted to show some, add some lightning on that. This time, along with Jessica, I need two more people to stay. Two more young adults or two more teenagers to stay. You ain't got to stand at one time. Don't look and say it to me. That's right. Thank you. Let's give my hand for stay. Come on, somebody else got to stay. Come on, okay. I need you, Jessica. You're going to start it off for us. It's all right. Give us the person that you interviewed. I interviewed you, but I also interviewed Kwanda. Yeah, Kwanda. I think she's over. Yeah, she's over there. Um, you want me to tell you the thing? Yes, yeah, tell us about Sister Kwanda. Where is Sister Kwanda? Sister Kwanda is over there. Sister Kwanda right there. Okay. What did you learn? Interview Sister Kwanda. Sister Kwanda is from Flint, Michigan, and it took them about 18 hours to get here as well. Um, Three characteristics about herself that her friends will say about her is that she's nice, she's caring, and she's comical. Mm -hmm. That's good, Sister Kwana. God bless you. Okay, I did Sister Kwana, but I'm going to move on to Sister Aisha from Harvey. That's where um, Sister Aisha. Aisha, come on, stand up, baby. This is Aisha Bird. Amen. Like I said, she's from Harvey, Illinois. Um, one of the people that she admires the most on the earth are the saints in the church. And the reason that she came here is that she wanted to get a better understanding. Amen. 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 I met the young brother Jamal. He said his motivation. Uh, what brought him here was God and the characteristic that he wants to be like that he wants. Who did you? Who did you? Oh, Jamal. He said he wanted to be more blessed like Jesus. Uh, so he came from us, uh, was Columbia. Amen. Missouri, and uh, she came here to hear the word of God, 
and one of the persons she admires the most is her pastor. Amen. All right. Give him God bless you. Come on. Um, Talking to Mike so you can hear you. I'm Mrs. Brianna Bell. I'm from Kansas City, Missouri. Um, someone I interviewed with Nathaniel Gamble. Talk to Mike. We can't hear you. Nathaniel Gamble, the third. And. One word he just, he described himself as was blessed. A part of Jesus' character he was most is his heart and spirit. And what he enjoys is music, singing, and also who he admires most is his father. His father. She said that she is here because she wants to be blessed and to fellowship with us saints from South Carolina. She said that she is from Dalton, Illinois. She said that if um, she had to describe herself in one word, she would describe herself as safe. And if someone had to say three positive words, they would say that she's honest, patient, and she encourages people. Yes. Come on over here. This side. All right, hello. I'm Brother Dewan from Harvey, Illinois. And the person that I've interviewed is uh, Sister Bernadette from South Carolina. All right. The first, the first, uh, the first question that I had to ask her is, is, what is? Does she know what her purpose is? And if so, what is it? And she said her purpose is to first be saved, and after that to be a light for other young ladies out there, you know, to, to lead them to Christ. Uh, describe herself in one word, she said, workaholic. <laughs> the, one character, the one character of Christ that she needs more of is faith. And then the, the last person I asked her was, was how, did, how did she come to Christ? You know, a, a brief testimony, and, and basically what she said was, you know, she was pretty much brought up in the church, and there were a lot of things instilled in her, so, you know, no matter what, she couldn't really get away from it. So. Amen. 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 Kansas, and the first, and the person she admires most is her mom, and she's very caring. 